at me. He's got the Conqueror's hockey. Quite the demon, aren't you? In this video, we'll be going over the 20 uses of Conqueror's hockey in One Piece, but it gets progressively better. If you think I missed a moment, let me know and comment down what was your favorite moment. Without further ado, coming in at number 20 is when Kid tried to use his Conqueror's hockey in Wano, but well, have a look for yourself. Are you crazy? Let go! Shut up and listen. At number 19 is the classic opening to Conqueror's hockey when Shanks decided to use it after giving Luffy his arm. Taking spot 18 will be Zoro's use of Conqueror's Hockey in order to reopen Kaido's scar. And 17th place, we have when Ace used Conqueror's Hockey as a kid in order to knock out the Blue Gem Pirates who kidnapped Luffy. Another great display of Conqueror's Hockey as a kid who took spot 16 is Doflamingo, his use of Conqueror's Hockey after making a devastating promise to those who wronged him. In 15th place, we have Luffy's first use of Conqueror's Hockey in order to stop Boa Hancock's sisters from destroying those who saved his life. <laughs> Coming in at number 14, we have Luffy unleashing Conqueror's Hockey once again, this time at Marine Ford in order to save his brother's life. <laughs> Hockey! Oi, oi! 
ジか驚いたね残ぞ In 13th place, we have Kobe's Conqueror's Hockey after landing a devastating blow to the Island Island Devil Fruit holder. In 12th place, we have the legendary Luffy and Bullet Conqueror's Hockey Clash that even shook Luffy's rivals. Then come at me. He's got the Conqueror's Hockey! In 11th place, we have none other than God D. Usopp's Conqueror's Hockey. Wait, that doesn't sound right. In the true 11th spot, we have when Shanks used Wi Fi hockey in order to get rid of the pest known as Green Bull from trying to fight injured fighters. Look in there! おかしいな。急な8やめてくれ。死に立ちには何も卑怯とは言わないがよ、海軍。死を変えて疲れ切った死。それはちょっとやぼじゃないか。そんなに怖いか。信じだいが。お前らと戦う気はねえ。まだな
パオウやっぱ資質あったかあの野郎これくらいやってもらわねえと戦地は交代だお前は俺がぶっ飛ばさなきゃなお前がどんなとこでどういう王になろう Coming in eighth place we have Roger and Whitebeard's Conqueror's Clash that split the skies on the first attack And at number 7th, we have Garp's Galaxy Impact Conqueror's Clash. This was at Pirate Island in order to save his dear pupil from his old pupil. Taking spot 6, we have Luffy radiating Conqueror's Hockey after going gear 5th with everyone feeling his presence. And in at fifth place, we have Shanks flexing his Conqueror's Hockey on the Kid Pirates using his old captain's move to disperse of them in one shot. In the fourth place spot, we have Shanks once again using his Conqueror's Hockey and Film Red to even bring an Admiral to his knees. In third place, we have Luffy and Doflamingo's iconic Conqueror's Hockey Clash that you could not escape in 2017, no matter how hard you tried in order to save Law's life. <laughs> Oh, 
の頭を砕き割ろうとしただけだ衝突だとやつもそうなのかお前じゃソフィーにはかなわんねえ In second place, we have Luffy and Katakuri's Clash. I know some of you knew this would be ranked this high up on the list just by how loved this fight is and one of Luffy's harder fights for sure. First place, I would have loved to put Joy Boy's use of Conqueror's hockey since that's the best display of hockey we've ever seen in the manga. However, since it has not been animated, this would be a tie between Zoro vs. King and Luffy's Red Rock. If you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to hit that like and subscribe button, comment down what was your favorite part, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let go! <laughs> 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 Luffy
नक्की रोशनी का